So, something a bit different for you. A toolbox tour. Uh, just for I'll show you what I, what tools I use and what tools I have and what tools I might be getting in the future. So we'll take you for a little tour. Start off. Well, with some money. Um, most of the stuff I buy is pretty much from anywhere, really. Blue Point, Snap On, Tang, Mac. Well, I've got no Mac. So we've got a Blue Point set, which I just cut the lid off, put in the top drawer. Got the Snap On 3 8 extensions, uh, Stubby Impacts. I've got this little set here, which I got off eBay for 20 quid. Pretty good set. It's got the um, different adapters. Go from steps. Uh, we've also got these spline tools I use for the flywheels. These are they're pretty good. They were cheap. Um, Snap-on tray. Um, I'm missing ten mil. Uh, Blue point stubby impacts. 30 mil. This little cheap set, which is done absolutely amazing. But I've got a snap on quarter ratchet because they're better. Then I've got the shallows. No, they're the, not the shallows. Yeah, I don't know. The yeah, yeah. yeah, For the quarter, they're for the quarter. Um, a long reach quarter and a stubby quarter extensions. And I've got 3 8 ratchet. Lower, short, long, and medium. They're really handy. That's the top drawer. That's pretty much complete how I want it. And we've got the blue point trim tools, blue point stubby ratchet spanners. Got the drill bits. Little tang set here. Bit set. Getting in those uh, those tight spaces. Jubilee things, mole grips and these are pretty good for uh, prying off pipes if you don't damage them. Tang crosshead spanners which are handy. And we've got some, well, I've got one missing, some pliers and snips and whatever, that's where they keep me gloves. A bit short on gloves at the minute, I think we all know why. We've got a bit of a messy drawer got like blades um, some other tools some other ratchet and spares and whatever we've got me wheel ones these um, snap-on wobbly sockets they're really handy we've got the snap-on half inch impact set long ones um, filter socket there a couple of lighters because I need to burn stuff then we've got the ratchets, uh, ratchets, not like spanners, uh, spanners, we've got um, 21, 22, 24 and 27 or something, um, big ratchets, spanners, we've got the long reach spanners here, these are, these are very, very, very handy, especially 10 mil. then I've got some, these are cheap, cheap, Nasty things I got off eBay a few years ago. A few other ones there. <clears throat> and that's when I normally keep me batteries. Got a couple on charge at the minute. I've got me Tang half inch set. Then I've got spare nuts, bolts, screws, whatever I need for anything. If, um, if something's missing, I'll replace it always. And we've got just a bit of everything, really. That's just a crap drawer. Then we've got all my screwdrivers, flats, picks, and little handy ones. Screwdrivers, flats, a little bit of a pry bar there. Also got a little um, dead sheep. Dead cheap grabber. Just in case I've dropped something. We've got another very messy drawer. Just whatever in it, really. 
then we've got some tang pitch scrapers and that and I've got a tang uh, puller, uh, bearing puller and I've got some um, chisels and pokes and stuff and I've got where I keep my boots so then we'll move on to the side cabinet we've got some just some extension bars uh, spare ratchet and stuff and then I've got these Sudoff scrapers, which we use um, on the heads or blocks to clean them up. They've got a really, really, really nice fine edge on them. Doesn't scrape, doesn't leave any marks at all on the heads or, or the blocks. Really good for getting the crap off. And I've got the fuel line and aircon tools to disconnect the fuel lines and the focuses and some uh, pick things and I've got me tapes just in case I've got these little things as well from Sudoff plier things, they've got the, uh, they're really good these they've got like grooves in them helps to get the clips in so they don't jump off and I've got a couple of wire brushes snap on soldering iron Then a couple of hammers, nice blue point hammer here. And then we've got the power tools, which I'll get out now. Yeah, so guys, got me all my power tools here lined up. So I've got the snap on 3 8 ratchet, really good, done me well this. Snap on little gun, 3 8 uh, the quarter ratchet, this thing mega absolute mega definitely recommend one of these guys mega I've got snap on drill recent purchase then we've got the snap on torch And then, got this guys, got this off eBay, got 40 quid, 3D printed, it's got an absolute mega um, thing on it. Now it's coming up to winter, like to get a bit stretched and stuff, so that thing's pretty good. And then we've got the Milwaukee high torque half inch impact gun. This, again guys, mega, for the price, for the price of it, like, it is definitely a worth, um, worth a buy, like, and it's, it's basically half the price of a snap-on. Yeah, so, let me just, uh, I'll just hook up this light. So this light, guys, works with the Milwaukee batteries and then put it on and it is bright guys it is bright got this under your bonnet yeah you definitely you know you can see everything so there we go guys that's all my tools that's my toolbox oh got the snap on breaker bar as well half inch now, the top on this, guys, I had this, um, me and my brother made it. I actually seen them for sale on eBay. But when I went to actually go and buy one, he stopped making them or something like that. So in the end, uh, got, the, got the metal from a, from a local steel merchant and pretty much made it myself. Me and my brother did it. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Got the sticker off eBay. And then I've got some some uh, LED lights for the winter. It's pretty epic. <coughs> yeah.
yeah so there you go guys that's my toolbox that's what i use on a day-to-day -day. so thanks for watching guys stay tuned for the next video